Hello guys, my name is Blue Digit, and welcome to another episode of the Killer Showcase for Daybreak 2. Today we're going to be talking about Yi Jun Im, aka the Idol. The Idol's active ability is your mind. The Idol can detect all survivors currently afflicted by obsession. This detect will last 2 seconds, but will negate any undetectable status effects. Followed by the passive ability, Obsessive Nature. The Idol can designate a survivor as his obsession by interacting with her icon. Survivors afflicted with obsession do generators 20% slower. Downing an obsessed survivor will make them start at 70% bleed out instead of 100. Killing an obsessed survivor will instead grant the Idol a temporary speed boost. The Idol also vaults 15% faster. So, I actually was recommended to play this killer by my friend Preekeeper on stream, I'm sure you guys have heard of him. Um, the reason why this killer is very interesting is because if you look at his base stats, he can move pretty okay, but his terror radius is huge, meaning he's almost a reverse stealth killer. But the reason why he's interesting is obviously because you cannot hide from this killer at all. If you use his ability correctly, you cannot hide from him, and he's given these little small boosts that make his base kit that much better. And it's very interesting to see how with these little add-ons that just are very slight, uh, slight tweaks, it helps make him oppressive in-game, and you'll see. So, um, if you haven't already, please subscribe if you uh, don't hate orphans, and uh, I've done this all live on Twitch. I've been trying to keep doing this series live on Twitch, and if you'd like to be there for the next episode, uh, I'd love to have you there. So, as always, smile, keep it up, and uh, let's jump into this video, guys. Okay, here we go. Once you lock. Um, Obsession, I think, is going to be nice. I just got to get the right feel for it. Um... I'm not sure, like, I'm not sure if I should be targeting first people that are Come on, let's dance. away from me or not. Okay, it's just so spread. Very spread. Okay. So, Z. Z, it's fate. Okay, there's them. Bro, what? Okay. Let's see where you are. There's one over here. Nice. Okay. This one's over here. Is that a flash? Yeah, I think it is. Oh. Yeah, no, you're done, Zoe. Flippy flap. Nice. Good down. That was great. Okay. So now I think there's that gen going on a little bit. Yeah, this one I can kick. Down. Nice. There's another one over here. Alright, let's see if we can do this. Shoot. They're going to loot me over here. I'm not afraid how, how, how do I know how often I can actually, like, get an obsession on someone? Hmm, that was an okay hit. I mean, not a uh, hit, but, like, I tried swinging for a bug. They're kind of, like, able to... This is, like, a, like a back and forth. They can just loot me. Like, what am I supposed to do here, realistically? Okay, that was mean. I feel a little bad about that, but it's also like... Okay. So she's obsessed now. Like, what am I supposed to do here, honestly, with, like, the... Yeah, like, these loops, like... I I'm literally chasing, I would say, in a... Pretty okay. And, like, what am I supposed to do here? Like, realistically. An emoji isn't like, I'm not even stuff. catching up. Unless I am... Yeah, like... With these loops, sometimes I'll get stuck, too. So you can't exactly pinch corners as well as like, you might like. I'm gonna keep saying this chase just to stay consistent. But, like, this might be something I have to leave. Just because, like, loops in this game, I have learned. Like, I'm literally trying my best right now, dude. 
Yeah, no, unless you do like a nice swing Stay around the corner. I'm not afraid to swing on you. Yeah, what am I supposed to do? Like, what am I supposed to do? And I'm vaulting? Yeah, I'm gonna have to leave this. I'm literally gonna have to, because, like, that's just terrible. Like, what can you do? So. Let's see where you are. Uh, I just, it's very disgusting to be playing that way. <laughs> that was great. Don't know why he didn't flash me. Unless he couldn't. What's going on? I'm trying to keep pressure on these gens so like they don't just pop them all. Nothing worthwhile. You're slowed down. Nice. That was good. That was good. I can choose another one now. And then... Oh, sorry. I wish I had a better idea. Um, with idle, it's usually best to target survivors with lower chase stats. Beautiful. Ooh, Down. Beautiful. Like it hurts. <laughs> oh well. Four gens left. I've got a good amount of pressure on these survivors though, which I'm pretty proud of. Beautiful. I knew they'd be back. And this one's also obsessed. You wanna fuck? That should have been hit. I'm not gonna lie. Beautiful. Good, 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 good. All right, so let's keep going around the corner. Where's our obs one, two, three? Good. Can I add another one? Yes. Oh, there's a cool- I see it. Okay, okay. I'm starting to understand the cooldowns. I'm starting to understand this a lot better now. I'm, I'm enjoying- yes. Good. Good, 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 good. We'll go back around. They can see me from up there, which is not the best, but... Can I even come up here this way? <laughs> That's funny. No, I can't. Um, over there, there's quite a few gens that they can jump on. But it's also like... He can get out of the game. And I think I'm going to. Straight up, yeah, I think I'm going to. Ah! I should've just connected! Ah, she's like, no! Oh, that's fucked. I'll take it, though. Alright, good. You see, that's good, too, because, like, that one was... That was a progress. Oh, that's... Oh, I gotta kick it. I'm kicking it. Regression for that is needed to me. I see you. But this is also the survivor that's like really good at like her chases. Shame. Shoot. I really am, I believe, doing everything I can best in this game right now. Let's see what you but nope, I'm gonna have to go back into a gen. So I'm gonna go jump on this because the more, yeah, there's three right now. So, you know what? I, I think this is, again, kind of like what I said about Jander one. The, mm, shame. That was on me. But you know, you gotta know when to leave chases. And right now, if I do get them, I mean, they're they're donezo. So that's what I've gotta do. Because obviously, like, if I can, and you know, the less people, the better. Ooh. Lost dog. Shame. Had a good run. Beautiful. All right, there's one down, and that's exactly it. So like now, obviously, like the way I'm able to just lower down the uh, the effects is better, and it's kind of sad because oh what? Okay. You know 
what you do here. I'll never leave. Dude, that was on me. Okay, that was a completely on me, dog. <laughs> that was bad. Huh? This guy have a lot more potential down a minute chase. And I know this. I didn't want to Beautiful. Do so made... even though that was it Y Colo whatever person kept looping me, the thing is at least when you know you can actually basically break break a loop, right? When you're able to actually leave a chase of a strong survivor and like go after the weaker targets. I mean, that's kind of the point of every single killer, right? You gotta know when you're gonna do these things. And that's what's gonna obviously give you that advantage. So, um, I'm honestly kind of proud of the way this turned out. I, I think this is a very good killer showcase. And honestly, I think it's gonna go on the YouTube. Because like, obviously I could have done a better job, but like, um, and especially my passive, because I had to do a better job understanding my passive. Like, I'm sure you can understand like, just by the way that the game went, like, you know, how one is supposed to, I guess, uh, execute in this game, so. Um, obviously I'm just gonna keep pressure, unless there is, like, the miss, like, right here. Um, as long as I hold it, I think I'll be fine, really. So, um, Stay back. yeah. I'm not afraid to swing we'll, on just, you. we'll just keep it like this. I mean, we'll, we'll play time if it comes down to it. Hi, Future Blue here. Um, it does come down to time. Quite literally, this chase goes on forever, because basically this is a infinite loop right here. Uh... Very interesting discussion to have later. Uh, I do think there's a little bit more to be studied here, and I'm still, like, a little bit new to, like, how exactly Chase does work with some things in this game, so keep that in mind. But, um, with everything I said prior to the video, please keep that in mind as well. Um, I want people to come away with from this, uh, still respecting what the killer is able to do, respecting the game, and, um, taking a, a good thing from this. So, um, don't, don't think this is how like, your games are always gonna go, um, but also don't, like, think it's not like this is just one of those things so um for everyone that is just looking for for like entertainment value um the video is basically over if you're interested in the chase and the mechanics of it um i still think it's pretty funny because it literally goes on for the rest of the duration so uh enjoy so because eventually either they're gonna leave or we'll stay here all that six minutes so and this is kind of the same thing that happened with Dead by Daylight. Like, unless, like, you're actually gonna, like, go confront the killer. Yep. Good job. This is what I'm talking about, though. Like, Chase should never be like this. Ever, in my opinion. The fact that it is, is like a huge problem. Like, this is like... To me, this is bogus. Like, if this isn't bullshit, I don't know what is. Like, what? There's times like I'm literally right on their back too and there's like nothing you can do about it. So. And I got stuck around the corner. Mm. The, the thing is, I think, for my opinion, I think survivors should only be able to vault a certain amount of times in an area until, like, it's blocked. Uh, that's like, I, I think that. Because this is bogus. Like, I'm doing kind of everything in the rule book right now that I can, like, just defeat them. Nope. 
they're literally chasing me the whole time. Yep, and it's going to. I was right at least. So, future blue, just do a montage. I'm sorry for everyone watching. This is something that they do. I, I think they need fix, obviously, because uh, like for killer, it's just it's super under, it's underwhelming. And I'm detecting them, but it's not really like what's it doing in chase, really. Like I do think multiple times I've mind game them, but just because of, obviously I'm getting stuck at certain points, which like you get stuck in any game, it's so whatever. But I mean, this, this so is. Much. I'm not afraid to swing on you. Like really? <laughs> Okay, I keep spamming space sometimes, and we get to look directly there. And it's... Ugh. She's gonna make a run for it. Mess up. Come on. Let's see what you got. No fucking shot. Did I actually fumble? I might have fumbled here. What? This is bogus. I'm not gonna lie. I'm actually getting pissed. What the fuck? What are you gonna do? What's, like, what the fuck? Yeah, let's see what you fucking got. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's see what you got. <laughs> Can't abuse this game no longer, huh? <laughs> let's see you fucking try. Let's see. <laughs> Let's see you keep fucking abusing it, bro. Oh, shame. I mean, there's nothing else you can do. But, like, this is my point. For any players, and I say this strongly for anyone that's like me, if you're new to the game, or if you just want to play casually, if there's people like this, do never, ever, 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 ever feel bad about moments like this. Because, I mean, it, it. all you gotta do is just expose how stupid the gameplay is. You gotta, like, expose how, like, this game goes when there's, like, moments like that. And just try your best to show exactly what you can do in the situations and what you can control. Obviously, in that situation, I've seen... I was in chase for three times. Beginning, first time, I realized, okay, I'm in this chase for a little bit too much um, committing. I gotta leave or else I'm gonna lose. So I put my pride away to keep chasing, right? The second time. Second time I jumped back in, right? Um, I saw them again. I thought I could maybe get it. No. I realized it was going to the same loop. I'm leaving it. Third time. Obviously, you saw that. Looped, 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 looped. As more of the limitations of this game, of how loops work and whatnot, but I think this was 100% exactly how you should do killer. And again, I'm not like if you're a new player, once you get to a higher level, um, or just like with people playing this game, and this is why like I'm not a big fan of Dead by Daylight right now. It's just you're gonna have people like that that are going to just you know use the game to its utmost limits. Which like why not? Obviously you want to win, you want to live. Like I don't understand why someone wouldn't do that. But um, if anyone ever does play killer like that, um. Obviously, think the way a killer would, right? You're going to go after your weakest victims and work your way up until there's only one left. Because if I just went after them when there's two other people, they would have got their gens done. 
I wouldn't have been able to pull that off. But because I did, even though they were able to loop me constantly, I was able to uh, pull that off Seems and uh, like have as problem. much pressure as possible just to put on them so that they wouldn't be able to escape. And that's what we won. So, um... Subscribe yes. to Blue Digit. What? Do it now. Hello. You are a cow. Yeah. Yeah. Subscribe to Blue Digit uh -huh. or else.